guys we have a like i used to say mission and as you can see we have a CLA 2014 Mercedes 2.5 liters engine and I decide to share because I have a challenge and actually not too many informations how you are removing the gearbox that is automatic in this case from the engine Usually, as we know, please, Joseph. Usually, as we know that actually this is dual uh, flywheel. Okay. Uh, usually, we know that uh, in most of the cases that we need to to, di to divide the engine and the top converter to stay inside the gearbox, we need to release the flywheel bolts perimetric from the top converter. In this case, we don't have this kind of system, and let's call it, uh, you are removing the gearbox uh, with the way that you are removing the manual gearbox. Actually, you need to untie it perimetric the bolts, like we did here, and pull it out. Now, we change the seal already. This is the rear rear crankshaft seal one comment when you putting back the flywheel try to don't remove the bolts don't lose anything see if you don't have my uh, information as i remove it i put it back i just change the seal now we we have tied the the flywheel and we will uh, put back the gearbox and I will show you how we are putting back when we reach to this stage so for now first info when you are when you are removing ah so one more thing I remove the engine complete because no space that work at least for me it's first time that I'm doing this job I will not like and, but I have experience from Mercedes uh, first, first uh, thing it, it was how you are removing it. So I want to say, don't try to find uh, bolts perimetric of the flywheel. No any access. You just untie it and gently you bringing it out like a manual gearbox. And with the same way we we'll put it back. Let's let me show you some. Uh, Things. Now, as you can see, this is the top converter, top converter for the from the side of the automatic transmission. Here we have the flywheel. So inside here we have bearing. So now what we want to do? Exactly the opposite uh, work. We need to clean very well the gears. We need to do whatever we need to do, and we need to attach the gearbox to the engine so let's continue and i will show you the time that we will put it how we are putting it we reach as i say we reach to the stage now to put the manual transmission on the engine now please what we did this is clean my own uh, sense okay Theoretically, if we bend the transmission like that, maybe we will uh, relocate the converter that we don't want to happen this thing. Even when you are ordering a gearbox or etc., they used to put a locker here to keep steady the top converter inside the gearbox. Now what we did, we lift a little bit the engine and we give this kind of loop this side. So when we will pick and put the gearbox to be like that, you don't have the chance to slip out. Now we will do it exactly uh, and we will record everything and to see what challenges will come. Because there is the point, to show in the challenges, not only to, to talk theoretically. 
Start, you are ready? Prepare your bombo. It's heavy, by the way. One, two, three. By the way, we clean also the gears and etc. Bring the bolts so we will uh, have, we tight everything that, we... no, 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 you don't need, just have it ready. You hold the engine steady so you will not bounce, okay? You Yusuf, this one, like that. See, it's already moving, steady, steady, I don't want this thing. Okay, hold it, ready? One, two, three, put it, lift. Put the bolt, wait, it's not locked. <coughs> Put the bolt. Now we enter. This is it. You just need to be careful, like I say. We put it into the drivers. And we are safe, we are tied now to secure. We don't want clearance. Put in here also. It looks simple, but it's not. Okay. We prepare it and we make one shot. There is the point. When you are doing this kind of things to understand with what you are dealing. As I said, I haven't done this job before on this specific vehicle. But I decided to share my experience. So, this is the way how you are removing the transmission, automatic transmission from CLA, probably the same engine because it's the turbo, as I say, 2.5 liters. Exist also 2,000 liters turbo. Exist a 1.8 liters turbo. Most of them, they have double flywheel because of the torque power and the picking, so they have uh, more smoothly uh, acceleration, let's say. So, this is generally the thing how it has to be done. And also you have to have strong waist and your bombo to be accurate. Anyway, thank you very much guys. One more mission complete.